In this video, we're going to talk about setting up your command manager. Throughout the series on kinematics, we're going to start by using Sketchblocks. Sketchblocks is one of those tools where you need to have direct access to the tools so you can quickly and easily make changes. There are several ways that you can get to Sketchblock tools. The first way is by going to your Tools dropdown, down to Blocks, and over to the appropriate tool you need to use. Now this takes a lot of time, especially when you're creating multiple blocks within a single sketch. The next way you can do this is by right-clicking and turning on the Blocks toolbar. Now this can be docked in several different locations, or it can be used on a second monitor. I don't particularly like to use these toolbars, but a lot of users do, so that's a good option for them. The next thing I like to do is click on one of my tabs, Customize Command Manager, and you'll notice that when the Customize window pops up, you have all the available tabs here, as well as this one on the right-hand side, to create a new tab. If we left-click on that, you can either select an empty tab to drag any tools that you want to on it, or you can pick one of the available toolbars. For me, I'm going to select Blocks, and that way I have a Blocks tab that I can use at any point in time. So I'm going to OK the customization, and now you can see I have my block tools all here. The last thing I want to do is look at keyboard shortcuts. So we're going to go to Customize, over to Keyboard, we're going to take a look at the Make Block command. Now this command you're going to use frequently. If you're creating lots of blocks in a sketch, it's going to save you a lot of time to have a keyboard shortcut for this. By default, this usually comes in as lowercase b. I'm going to go ahead and leave that at b. For some reason, you've overwritten this or it's not the same on your end. Make sure that you can get to a key simply by highlighting it and typing that key on the keyboard. This will make it quick and easy for you to create these blocks. That concludes setting up your command manager.